In this episode of Flea Market Rescue, I'm going to take you along as I go to Lansing, Michigan to meet one of the viewers of Flea Market Rescue. We'll take a little tour of her house and then she's going to show me a few of the thrift stores and specialty shops in her area. We'll even do a project on her counter and celebrate her birthday with a little cake and coffee. So if you're ready for a fun-filled episode, then let's do this. Just a quick note before we get started, if you're new to Flea Market Rescue, I just want to welcome you. I'm so glad you found your way here. My name's Kelly Sherry. I do a lot of thrift flips and furniture makeovers, so I hope that you'll consider subscribing to my channel, and if you ring the bell, you'll get notified every time I post a new video. So you're probably wondering how I met Delane Wright. Well, she wrote in saying, I have the same countertop as you. And we started talking and saying we were the countertop twins. And I thought it would be really cool to go over and do a project on her counter. So I'm heading to Delane's house. Um, it's probably about a two hour drive. It's her birthday today. I got her a cake. It's a birthday without a birthday cake. I have to say I was a little disappointed when I'd seen this writing. It looks like a 10 year old did it. We're gonna go thrifting. We're gonna do a project on our counter. So I can't wait. We'll see what today brings. So I headed off from Sterling Heights to Lansing. I could have never anticipated just how fun this day was gonna be. Really? You are just gonna oh, love what? Delane so Wright. She is a hoot and just so much fun. She met me with such a warm welcome as if I was a long lost friend. Hi, Hi so nice to meet you. It's so nice to meet you. Delaine gave me a tour of her house, and the upstairs is a craft room, which I love. She has stencils, she has yarn, she has all kinds of really cool things. I really love her furniture pieces. They're vintage, and all of them have a story behind them. Most of them were passed down from family members. Did I tell you that Delaine loves lambs and cats, which makes her even cooler? And do you know, she even has a signed photo from Carol Duvall. Carol Duvall, who started it all. When I was a little girl, um, I used to watch her little craft minutes. And it was to my mother's horror when I would go up to people in the grocery store or the meat man and say, why don't you have the meat trays that Carol Duvall has? And my mom used to try to get me to forget that she was on. She'd say, no, she's not on today. I'd be like, yes, she is. And uh, it was the most embarrassing when I asked a lady for her egg carton in the store, could I have that when she was done with it? So I got to meet her a few years back. I don't see a date on this. That well, was a very long time ago, I guess. And I got pictures with her. I had to stand in line like an hour. But, and, and I had a good friend that was willing to do that. And um, I was just thrilled. She had been an idol of mine forever. She started in Detroit. I have to admit, my family was a little concerned about me meeting a complete stranger. And as we went down in her basement, I couldn't help but feel like, oh, I hope they're not right. But nope, she turned out to be just a normal person with a lot of cool stuff. She has all her containers that she can store things in. And then she has these shelves that all her thrifted finds are on. I literally want to go shopping in this. Just take a look at all her cool stuff. Unbelievable. Look at this. She has it so organized. Like you just could come here and pick something out and literally work on it. Love this. I'm so glad she wasn't a serial killer and we laughed all about it. I have to admit, she has a really cool basement. My mom even wanted to know, where did she get those shelves? She told me Costco's. Now for the moment I had waited for, to see her countertop. And there sat the homeliest sheep figurine I have ever seen. I'm going to let Delane tell you about it. Hello, Kelly. Welcome to my countertop. Thank you for coming today. The ugliest sheep ever. A few years back, my mom and I were thrifting and going to antique malls on my birthday. And he was way high and the lady brought him down. And my mother said, 
That's the ugliest sheep ever. I might have to agree with her mom on this one, but by the time I left, that sheep had grown on me that I wanted my own, and I wanted a dead cactus right on the top like hers. <laughs> oh, hilarious! It was time for her to open a few gifts before we went on our thrifting adventure. Oh, I have a few different ones for you. <laughs> What's a party without fun and festive so gifts? So I bought her this happy birthday headband, but then she did tell me she likes cats. So I thought she might like these too. These are little fun cat headbands. But really, if you like cats, you're gonna love this. Look at that. And if that wasn't cute enough, look at that. I got her a tiara. And a party isn't a party unless you have those little blow horns. And and have some festive beads. I think this goes well. Yeah, Does it go it's, well with it's my... perfect with your oh, hair. Yes, definitely. I'll have, to, I'll have to wear it all day. I have a few other ones too, just in case you didn't like that. I have a few other ones. <laughs> You'll definitely see more of that later, but right now we need to get on to our thrifting adventure. So our first stop was the St. Vincent de Paul thrift store, and this place was amazing. I'll put all the places we visit in the description so that you can find them. I can't even believe this is a Vincent de Paul. Look at this. Oh, they do such a nice job. This is amazing. Mm -hmm. Whoever does the decorating there does a fabulous job. Someone knows how to decorate. Oh, it's made in China, but it's only six ninety nine. You can't beat that. No. Uh -uh. Ooh. <laughs> in this area, I usually um, just buy for myself. <laughs> People are going to want to come to this one. I'll tell you. <laughs> I think so. I think so. Look at this. Oh, he's from Japan. Ooh. Oh, I love him. I'll hold on to I him. I told you she Ooh. likes cats. I do love cats, and I love all their vintage, um, whatever you call it, uh, <laughs> linens. Oh, what's this? What that's is stinking? No, cute. I think that's a pig. <laughs> it's so a little yeah. piglet? I think it's a little oh. piglet. It's a thimble? No. No? Is it no. a bell? I don't know. We don't know. We don't know. He can stay here. For 99 cents. Wow. I love this place already. I know. Told you so. I'm just getting it to cushion my items. They have all the vintage type linens, even like a hook rug. Oh, that's a nice rug. Oh, so Over cute. Over here, they usually have like the country farmhouse stuff. Farmhouse oh. stuff. Oh, yeah. look at all these cutters. Look at all the cookie cutters. $1.99 a bag. Wow. Do you do cookie cutters? I don't. I don't, but wow, that would be such a sale for someone. Well, what's that? With you know, I see that all the time. I'm really not sure what that is. Maybe someone out there can tell us. What is that? Why does it have that? It looks like a little yeah. man. Why does it have <laughs> that thing in there? I don't know. Okay. Oh, look at all those needles. So that you can do it in wool. Oh, my goodness. Look that at will put the wool Look what she just together. found. Number 32. Wow. And Felting see. needles. And change the needles out. That is so cool. I think cool. I'd have to buy that. Yeah, if you didn't buy that, I would buy that for oh, sure. Oh, well, then maybe you should buy it. Oh, it's okay if you want. It's your birthday. Oh, yeah. I'm not going to... Yeah. yeah, I'm going to just... <laughs> now, is this... Are these felting needles, too? Good That's question. So cute. The little rabbit? Yeah. But it doesn't look like you can take those out. Pyrex. Oh, I love this cart. Oh, not for sale, though. Yeah. Yeah, I can understand why. They got to keep some stuff for display. Baskets over here. Behind here, that's 
$6.99 board there. It? Yeah, let's here, I let me that. help you get it. I don't know what it looks like. It looks is like it something I need. I don't know. Oh. This is $19.99. But the board behind I know, it. let's yeah. see. Oh, it's got a um That's really cool too. Yeah, this is beautiful. It's very heavy. Oh, it's wow. a menu board, yeah. It looks like they did it on the back though. Do you, like there's nothing oh, yeah. raised on this. Right. Okay. I think I'm gonna have to get that. This? That yeah, is this is great. Cool. And for six ninety nine I think it's well worth it. Oh yeah. It can be oh, some it's kind of soft. display board you can pin things to. Oh. Yeah, I'm gonna get it. Okay. This wreath is so pretty. Look at this. I wonder how much this wreath is. It is, nice. it is beautiful, but yeah, let's see. $34.99? No. That's beautiful. Mm -hmm. I think it includes the, oh, um, whatchacallit. Not bad. Yeah, but I could it totally see 500 like, pounds. <laughs> I could see that. like a big chunky candle oh. and some, you know. Beautiful. Stuff around there. Look at the stuff that they display this in, too. Even though it's not for sale, it's just oh, the it's leaded gorgeous. glass. It's beautiful. I am really loving this Vincent de Paul. Look at that. Okay, let me see. Let me see how much is that one. I'm going to try to find out. Oh, look at that. That is so sweet. I'm looking. Oh, I found it. Show me. You can't see my mouth. Do you see that? $12.98. Wow. How can you pay it? Oh, it's not done. It's not done. Look, are any of them done? See, it's printed. Oh, it's printed. Okay. Got oh, it. I guess I'll leave it. Not cleaned out. <laughs> yeah, that is really nice too. I could totally see that. And then as you make your way around there, you uh, they always have cool stuff. I'm they got the memo that they're supposed to get out the coolest stuff. They do. They, they have the coolest stuff, for sure. <laughs> Look at that. Oh, that's beautiful. Yeah. Look at that. Oh, that's beautiful. Yeah. Look at that. Oh, and then they have vintage clothing right over here. If you're into vintage clothing. It's pretty creative because it's still got the sled stuff. $30. Yeah, really that's bad at all. really good. You have the antiques here. Like, it's unbelievable. Yeah, that's really good. I wonder how much this one is. That same thing happened to me too. <laughs> the two little dishes. Lennox wear. Oh, it doesn't have price on it. I don't think that chair does either. I don't think so either. I think you're right. Although sometimes. It's mm -hmm. like they have a matching cradle too to go yeah. with it. Oh, yeah. Let's see. I see a tag on the cradle. I wonder. Oh, it's Maybe it's a set. Nope. $14.99. No. $14.99. For oh, it this. says set. Bed and chair. <gasps> you're right. It is a set, $14.99. Can you believe that, you guys? This is just crazy. Yeah. Wow. You guys, look how old that is. <laughs> look at the fabric on it. Look at the ugly baby oh, in it. <laughs> you're not kidding. Oh, this one is so ugly. It made out mm, of... Mm, well, yeah. Well. <laughs> he's only a dollar ninety-nine. Doesn't it make you want to love him? No. <laughs> I have a habit of adopting things that other people don't like. Lots of games. What's this? $3.99. That's nice. Yeah, that's really cute. But look at that picnic basket, picnic. like you said. Picnic. Oh. Oh, wow. Oh. 
wonder how much that is. Well, I don't see a mat for sale yet. No price. Oh yeah, that's right. It's very expensive. No. All right. Tell We're them. gonna have to fight over it. Oh no. <laughs> We're gonna fight. It's over your birthday. It. No fighting. Yeah. Look at it upside down. It is four ninety nine. Chicken egg. Wow. Chicken egg. You just scored. Yes. Totally scored. Look at that. I know. <gasps> that's what we paint. And that's exactly what you're gonna see us do on her counter a little bit later. Those. Let's see the inside. Look at the it's paper all on them. Deckled. You guys, look at what you could do with this. Oh, look at their hurt. Okay, wow. let's see how much. Three dollars. Three dollars. That's not I think bad I'm at taking all. her. Because I love her. Look at her. So this is the crafting aisle. Polymer. Okay. Glue guns. glue guns. Hey, we may need those <laughs> yeah, later, right? Yeah, we may need some glue guns. No, I have two glue guns. I think I gotta get them though. Yeah, for ninety nine cents. For ninety nine cents, how can you pass them up? How can you pass up glue guns? Needles. Did you see all the knitting needles in my upstairs? Look at all the old patterns too. Oh yeah, have. those are good for craft. They are good to use as decoupage. Oh yeah. To have a that old look on it. Right. And look at a quarter, like a quarter for a pattern. That's crazy. Wow, you guys, this is really incredible. Oh, but is there anything for us? It doesn't mean that there's not stuff for us. True, true. Okay. Uh, it's this is usually 100% full. Oh, it is? Yes. Wow. Yes. Now I saw, I, that's a cool little thing. You wouldn't have to use it as that. Right. I saw somebody take a gun cabinet and stack all their quilts in it. Have I've you seen, seen that? that? Yep, I have seen oh, that. Oh, that makes me laugh. Someone though. actually um, offered one to me for free. <laughs> but yeah. I was like, you know what? I have enough stuff right now. Oh, okay, look at that. I think this would be for rubber stamps. Oh yeah, I can see it in a craft room. Yeah, four ninety nine. Only four ninety nine. Yeah. I just spotted this big E here. That is really cool. Um, it was thirty dollars clearance, but I wonder what their price is. Three, three ninety nine, you guys. We have a lot of antique beds, $24.99. I've always wanted to do one of those ones where you make a bench. Oh, I've done a couple of have them. Have you done? Yep, I've done a couple of them. They came out really good, too. Because look at that dark one back there. Oh, I yeah. like that. I like this part of it. Oh, yeah. Oh, that's in But That's only, what is that? That is only $12.99 for that one. I mean, these prices are just incredible. Yeah. This right here would make such a cool sign. I was thinking about getting it and cutting the legs off over right here. Yeah. I could do flea market rescue on there, paint it all white, distress it. And then it has another really cool part on the bottom. That would make a nice sign too. It has a curved seat. Is 49, 49. Wow, this chair is like fit for a king. It's only thirty dollars. Look at the legs on this. Thing. These are kind of cute right there. Yeah. Oh, 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 oh. Oh, did you find something? Look, yeah. these are oh, cloches. They are, but I love your little pedestal. Look I at this, you guys. I think that's cute. My mom would it's love it. It's a Bath and Body Works. $2.99. $2.99. That's worth it because it's you adorable. So? Oh, my God, there's two of them. <laughs> oh. Look, look. 
You are you are right. You are spot on. Hey, How much me, is that? I'm gonna tell you. A dollar ninety nine. Put the chicken in the oh, basket. We're right? gonna put the chicken in the basket. The chicken in the basket. <laughs> and here's oh this. And there's one. another one too. Oh look at this one. Oh. This is perfect. <laughs> oh this this one is two ninety nine. Two ninety nine. Oh, this is plastic, so it probably... Oh, is that oh. a turntable? No, it's actually a little sign, though. Oh! But because it's plastic, I don't know if it would really go. But you could put, like... You could make it a lot cheaper, and then someone would buy Sterling. it. Sterling. That is? Well, I think it's a gravy boat, but I think it's also Ironstone, but it says Sterling on the bottom. $1.99. Dollar ninety nine. You have to get it. It's my birthday. That's right. It is. I just get it. It's my birthday, and I'm wearing a dang tiara. She is. I yeah, love but it. it doesn't say happy birthday. People I know. Just think I'm weird. <laughs> After St. Vincent de Paul, we decided to go get something to eat. We stopped at Acapulco Mexican Cuisine. And let me tell you what, their food is amazing. I definitely recommend it. So we decided to eat Mexican food. There's the birthday girl right there. And her non-birthday tiara. <laughs> All right, so our food just came and I can't even believe how fast it was. It literally was like seven minutes. It's faster than McDonald's, isn't it? Wouldn't yes. you say? Oh, I couldn't believe it either. I know. Uh, Acapulco Mexican Grill in Lansing. Yours <laughs> looks amazing too. Oh, I love it. We're having an awesome lunch, and then we're gonna go see a few more things. Goodwill in Mason, Michigan. Yes. Look at this. Oh my gosh, you guys. I have to see. $150. Oh, it looks beautiful. Wow. But there's some boards behind you. I don't know why you're not pulling it out over there. <laughs> okay, so I will. One, two, it's, oh, I don't want them. I want them without, without the, the berries. Yeah. yeah. One, it's, oh, a lot of them here. Yeah, it's four for a dollar. That's really cheap. Yeah. Kind of confused. It says 10, 20. Is that for all of them? Oh, it's got to be. Here. I am going to get these because these are so cool for a booth. So 10, 29, I think, for the whole thing. What'd you find there? Four, four ninety nine a suitcase. Oh. Look at this. There's yeah. another one. These are like the great ones that you can make over. Oh yeah, that definitely for four ninety nine. You do like a French logo on top. Let oh, add some yeah. Legs to it there. Yeah. Yeah, that would be super okay. cute. What about the blue one? Do you want one? I, I already did so many suitcases. You I, did? Yeah. <laughs> but they are very cool. Yeah. I, I think you can't help but take them. I mean, that's a great price $4.99. And they, like you said, yeah. they're the good ones here. They are the good ones. Yeah. I just want to make sure there's no dead bodies inside. <laughs> nope. Nobody's dead. Nope, nobody dead. We're good. That is really cute, but they have it at ten dollars. Yeah, Twenty-nine that's cents. That's too much. Out of all the places we visited, I'd have to say this is my favorite. It's Maple Street Mall, and it is awesome. Wait till you see inside. Let's go ahead and take a peek. Now, Maple Street Mall is like a consignment store, and when you walk in, the first thing you see over to your right is a whole bunch of Dixie Belle paint. I was just thrilled because I've never used Dixie Belle and Marilyn Green, she showed me the products, kind of went over them, and she also did show me the whole store, which you're going to get to see in just a little bit. 
So if you guys are looking for any Dixie Belle paint, I'll leave Marilyn Green's information in the description. She does ship and I'm sure she'll send you any of the products that you might see here in this video. I know I bought a lot of paint from her and you're going to actually get to see us use some of that on that basket that we got from the thrift store when we do the trash to treasure project on Delane's counter. Right, so let's take a tour around the store. Thank you, Marilyn, for showing me around. You guys, look at this bench. How cool is that to use old doors? Oh my gosh, you guys, look at this stuff. It's just absolutely gorgeous. And I did not see that or I probably would have bought that up there. There's just so many cool things in the store. This is just the beginning. Now, couldn't you see this on a porch of a cottage? I love that little picket fence. That shelf is really cool that with the mason jars on it. Old shutter. I love the pig cutting board. There's just so much to look at. I love this. I know some of you like Pyrex out there, so I thought I'd get a good shot of all this. Now, I thought this was a really cool booth. This is by Sharla Horton, and her company's called Busy Bee Creations. She makes these beautiful hats for witches on the town. She sells an unbelievable amount of those. Now she's gotten into cowboy hats That's for the really summer. Cool. Isn't that fun? Yeah. And then the fascinators. Oh, the fascinators too. Huh? For the Kentucky Derby. Oh, sweet. Or like that, the Kentucky Derby. All right, you guys, you know where to get your hats. She does a phenomenal job. I can Doesn't totally she? see that. Very nice. And then she has a few other things here. Isn't that the truth? This is our happy place. Right. <laughs> it definitely is. Oh, look at these. I might Get need to have them. I just saw those. She also just broke these in. That is, is a that? great pig. I like this. She's $24, but I love him. A $24 pig? He's yeah. worth a $24 pig. Oh, yeah. I love this. Cool. Oh, that's a sheep. Oh, oh, oh. Yeah. I have a problem with sheep. I love sheep. <laughs> yeah, I have a little bit of a lamb problem. <laughs> she really likes lambs. I like lambs. I might have to. We could have. Well, okay, let me think about him. Okay. Oh, but look at that lamp. Oh, I should come down here. This should be against the rules. Which way they went. <laughs> they went that away. Look at that wood. Isn't that cool? That is so cool. Great table. Wouldn't it? Oh, and a ladder. How much is this ladder? I might need a ladder. It's not too much. Oh, it's 45. It's more, what, more than what I want to spend, but it's super cool. Oh, that is a cool ladder.
Now this booth had to have been my most favorite booth there. This girl has it. Wait until you see inside here. Just look at the blankets on the ladder. It's just so warm and cozy. It's just beautifully decorated. Like I said, this girl has it. They have these awesome candles here. Smells so awesome. Now this woman also has clothing pieces as well. Her name's Barbara Street, and we're gonna look at that next. She takes some um, clothes and repurposes them, and refashions them into something different. And like, look at this, just a regular blazer. Oh yeah. And she attached this beautiful fabric. That is really nice. And she does a lot of flannels, too. And she's the one who has the candle booth, right? She's the one, yes. She does a lot of flannels, where she adds men's flannels, which is nice because they're nice and loose for women to wear with oh, something yeah. under them. Cute skirts. She does a Very great cool. job. Again, these are just some of the booths at Maple Street Mall. There's plenty more to see, and if you ever get a chance, I would definitely take a road trip there because not only do they have Dixie Belle paint, they have fabulous vendors. All right, I totally scored here. Look at all this stuff. Isn't that gorgeous? And I got tons of Dixie Belle paint. Yay! This place is so worth the drive. I'll leave a link in the description just in case you want to take a road trip there or maybe you saw something that you might want. I just really enjoyed myself there and I think you would too. Okay, so we are at the Mega Mall. It's open seven days a week and this is where Delane has her booth. We're gonna check it out. People love coming here and we're gonna see why. I'm bringing Kelly to show her my booth. This place is just packed with things. Absolutely packed. And I see they run a lot of sales, which is nice if you find something. Here it is. All right. My booth. So let's one take a look here. In. She's had this for one month. Oh, your prices are so reasonable. Look at that. Love the table. Oh, I'm yeah. thrilled. A couple of my things I put in recently have sold. That's always great. Yeah, it's always good to look at the little bunnies. Oh, I have one of these. I love that. I do too. Again, your prices are so reasonable. Very nice. Oh, look you guys. She did the cans. Oh, and this one is in white. How cute. I love this little table. My mom would love it too. Did you, how did you do this? That's, that's a stencil. That's a stencil, huh? Yeah, I'm really finding that I like the stencils, to do stencils a lot. This is a stencil um, that's painted black with the Dixie Belle silk paint. Oh, okay. And that's like a glaze oh, or a patina thing. And then that's some paint inlays from, um, that's done with the paint inlay. Oh, nice. Okay. And this is the um, sunflower stamp. Oh, yeah. You know what? Hey, you guys, do you remember in our group she posted this? Yes. Com completely finished. Yes, I'm thrilled with it. And I don't remember where I got that, but that's painted blue. I'm trying to remember what blue it was, but with white wax. 
I like to use wax a lot. So very nice. Yep. I'm pretty happy with it. Yeah. So Delaine is just starting out, but I think she's off to a great start. Delaine, I just want to say good job, and also I would have been very disappointed if I did not see one cat or a sheep in your booth. Now we're just going to take a quick look around here because we still have a trash to treasure project to do on Delaine's counter in a little bit here. This is her friend Charlotte's booth. Look at that basket. We actually picked one up like yes, that today, we did. didn't we? we? got a picnic basket. I and all this stuff. Love this. This is nice. This is a good price for the... Yeah, and yeah. It, is this all half off, you said? Hey, Olive. Yes. Charlotte's booth. this piece. This is incredible. Wow. That is really a statement piece. And it's $98. I don't feel that that is bad at all for this. It is a beautiful piece. Isn't it? I mean, where are you going to find something like this? I don't know. I thought this was really cute. I love this. This was a really cute booth, I thought. For all of you who love the roosters. Oh my gosh, we just picked up one of this. We did? Isn't that what I bought pretty close? Oh, let me see. Oh, it sure is. <laughs> look, <laughs> look, you are, you are right, you are spot on. Hey, How much me, is that? I'm gonna tell you. $1.99. Oh, it sure is. <laughs> I thought this was a really interesting shelf. I really regret not getting these. These were so cool. I saw Delane eyeballing this cat, but then I was like, wow, look at all these poodles. Someone really My loves poodles. Spaghetti poodles. They're called spaghetti poodles? Yeah. See the little spaghetti? Oh. And they're highly collectible. See, I did not know that. You, you were unaware of the spaghetti poodle. No. Well, now you've learned. So glad I could add to your knowledge. I just love her. She is so much fun. All right, so we need to get back to her house and start this project. And as you know, I bought a lot of Dixie Belle paint from Marilyn at Maple Street Mall, and we're going to use some of it on our basket. You're doing. <laughs> that gives me the dirty job. Yep. On her birthday, I'm making her clean, clean. it. Clean. Yeah, I have to clean. So she's just wiping it up because, again, we got it from yeah. the thrift store. and You never know who's been picnicking in here. This is true. Yeah. And then we need to get this off here, so we're gonna do that next. So I'm thinking that if we you take that off. Oh yeah. Well, I think I think these pliers. What are these? I think they're like little push, you know, like a little pushback things. I, I think we have to do it from the inside. You think it's that, uh, that's what I think. And I'm just gonna bring that up. Okay. I'll hold this up, and then I could hit you in the head with it. <laughs> because my family was afraid that she was gonna kill me. Yeah. <laughs> the night's not over. It's not. No. And then she's gonna have a lot of great stuff because I bought some wonderful things. This is true. But they're in her car already. That's all right. I'm sure she'll be able to get the keys out of my pocket. Right. You don't have one of those fingerprint things, do you? No. Am I gonna have to do the thing where? You know, I steal your fingerprint and... Oh, she's really thought about this. I have, I have. <laughs> right? Okay. Ooh. Oh, I broke this though. That's okay. Look you it. That we're okay, hold that. keeping it. Look. She's oh, destroying there. things here. Look it. Oh, oh, oh. I think we got it. And now we just have a button on the front. <laughs> <laughs> Nobody will notice that. Okay, where's the... Oh, well, what do we use? We got all kinds of screwdrivers. You're taping this? Yeah. Oh, okay. 
it better look like I know something. <laughs> like, a, this isn't my first time crafting. Here, let's do that. Why are you leaning backwards? Because I'm afraid that's going to shoot right in my eye and then I'm going to... Yeah. <laughs> yeah, you'll have to stay here. <laughs> hey, you ever watch that, um, Misery? <laughs> every piece of it. Are we actually going to throw that in the trash? You can use that? No, we can keep it if you want. Yeah. I could <laughs> glue it back together. She's very thrifty. Yeah, I guess. <laughs> I think it breaks really. It's obviously not brass. Well, no. <laughs> Since I was able to break it. Either there, she's really strong. <laughs> well, I didn't want to let my hulkness come through. Okay. Oh. This is probably the worst part of the rest of it. Oh. oh, that's okay. But we can glue that. We can glue it. We got hot glue. We got hot glue. Oh, see, in this, look how good I did. I got the whole thing you off. You got the whole thing. Okay. Well, right. one of these isn't bad. Here. I probably should get it closer to me. Here, put your head over here. <laughs> now get it to that way. Here, I got it. Did you get it? Yeah. It's almost done. All right, you did it. You got yeah, it. Yeah, look I'm, at I'm that. I'm proud of you. And it's yeah. not too much damage. We can put yeah. a little hot glue, and then once we paint over it, it'll be fine. Or we could put that star bun. Did you buy any of that mud? Um, did I? I did, but black. Oh. But we still could put that over and then do the white. Right. Oh my Should we gosh. try it? Okay. All right, so we're just going to open this up. We're going to try this product. I have never used this before. That um, popsicle stick. What's really nice, what she told me about this product here. She told me that you could do like raised lettering on a stencil, so I have to try that out on another project. But right now, we're going to use it just to see if it fills this in because it's, you know, if it yeah. raises a stencil, I'm sure it could. Well, I've seen other people do that. At least that's what I thought they would do. Okay. Doing. I'll keep wiping and cleaning while you do all the fun stuff. Okay. Yeah. Oh, that is really, it's. Oh, it really it's is. It's like mud. Let me smell it. It doesn't smell bad. You smell okay. it. I look like you were going to taste it. <laughs> a little like, taste test here. A little taste test. All right. Oh, I think that, I think that's going to be good. What do you think? I think it probably will work. I think it's going to work fabulous. Did I break anything else? Okay, so we're just gonna let that dry. We kind of like filled in the little holes. I think it should be fine though. I think so. All right, and so I guess that's what that's all about. Uh -huh. All right, so I put some of that mud. As you can see, it dries like, you know, gray. We do have a line here, but it's actually kind of smooth. That's because I was sanding on it. I think it'll be fine once we get a little paint on it. So while I've been fixing that, she has been sanding down the top, making everything nice and smooth. And the handles. And the handles. She went above and beyond. This thing's going to be awesome. Yes. It okay. should be awesome. Nobody should get a splinter. Okay, so now that we have the front fixed and she has sanded down the entire basket, yeah. we are going to paint it white. Yes. So, With Dixie Bell. Yeah, Did where's the paint? We're gonna, I think it's fluff oh, that fluff. we picked out. Dixie Bell fluff. Yep, we're going to try that on there. Again, I've never really used Dixie Bell, so we're going to try it out today. I use Dixie Bell. It's good. Okay. It's really good. You're going to decant the paint, aren't you? Decant the paint? Yes. It's mandatory. So you have to take the paint, take out what we think we're going to use, so we don't contaminate the container of paint. All the cool kids do it. Why well, keep sanding? Five hours. I don't later. know. I don't know. Like I don't do that, but but okay. It's my house, and, my and it's her birthday too. And it's my birthday too. So we'll do what she day. wants to do. Okay. Sanding. I'm and, still sanding. And she wants more sandpaper. I wanted more sandpaper. Well, 
I don't want any, I want it to be smooth. It has to be smooth. When we get done with this, we're going to have to charge $115 just to make up the time that... <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh -huh. Now, can you get me the tack cloth? Are no, no, that's not the tack cloth. The special tack cloth that should be in the basket of things we brought up from downstairs. I do not see a tack cloth. But... What do you mean you don't see the tack cloth? We must have a tack cloth. Do we need a tack cloth? Oh, definitely. We must get the dust off, my sanding dust off, before we proceed. This thing just went up to $150 now. <laughs> no wonder I'm not making money at the booth. <laughs> yeah. Um, yeah. Just a little bit more. Just a little bit more. Just a tiny bit. All right, so I am going along with this because it's her birthday, but I would never do any of this, okay? I just want you to know that. Um, decanting the paint, cat cloth, I mean, I don't know. Wait till you see the beauty. Yeah. I'm just trying to teach her some painting standards that we use here in Lansing. <laughs> this is the Lansing standards. Although, I think it does look very beautiful. It's very smooth. It, you know, there are scissors. I know, but it's not working. It's not working? No. No. I can't get to it. It's like so tight well, in there. Oh, uh, here we go. Oh, okay. I got it. Maybe I should have put my glasses on this. Oh, yeah, glasses. I wear mine all the time because of this. Okay, so again, we are going to use the Dixie Belle, the fluff. We'll try that. If she's ever done sanding. Yeah. <laughs> Okay. You start painting over there. All right. It's going to work Deal. a little bit more. Deal. Oh, oh wait. No, I got to decant this thing. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. You have to decant. Just pour a little bit in the... Uh, yeah, maybe we want to add some water. We need a little water, don't you think? And I brought my mister, my special mister, um, what's okay. that thing? Bottle. Um, mister, special mister bottle. I don't use a mister either. I, I really like mister. I think we should mist the basket first. <laughs> <laughs> oh my God, we're hilarious. Mm. And we haven't even been drinking. Okay. No, we have so, not been drinking, but after this, I think I'm gonna, you're gonna, gonna start one. You're gonna start. Okay, so here, you can pick your paintbrush. Um, you want to use a chip I, brush? Yeah. Can I? Oh, well, yeah. it's what I'm used to using. Okay. Well, I'll use this higher end brush. Mm. Mm -hmm. <laughs> or maybe this. Oh, this would be a good one. Okay. So, uh, where's your. Do you think we should add some water? I think we need to add water because okay, it's can, pretty this is thick. The, now, she wants to miss that, and that's fine, but I think that we should do like straight paint right on this part here. Oh, that's a good idea. So, I'm just going to dip my brush into the decanted paint. And <laughs> I'm just gonna add a little on the front here, hmm. and then she can mist everything else. <laughs> All right, you guys. Um, <laughs> I know that I didn't have the camera down. I'm so sorry, but I just took straight paint and I just covered up those spots. And now we added a little water to the paint. The paint, and she used her mister. <laughs> I know, but because I think the mist. If you put the mist on here, then the the mist water goes we'll make into the, the paint. Will right. flow better. Okay. okay. All right. So we're just going to get in here and we're going to just start painting this basket. Yeah. Oop. It probably is going to require two coats, but that's okay. Let's run in a little. Oop. Was I not supposed to paint over there? Oh, boy, we're good at this. Now you know I'm sloppy. I don't. I am too. Okay. Oh yeah. Because. Again, I don't have a lot of patience <laughs> for sanding, sanding misting, and misting. decanting. Oh, yeah, <laughs> the decanting is very important, I have to tell you. I, I, I'm hoping people in the comments will agree with my decanting, but sometimes you get really excited about just, you know, getting in and putting the paint on. I, I'm sorry, but I got a little paint on your counter. Oh, God. Oh, not like that's ever happened before. Here in Lance. Yes, in Lansing. In, in Lansing. Lansing standards. Our Lansing standards. Anybody from Lansing watching this? Does anybody know me watching this? They're all going to know you now. Oh, I know. This is frightening. You're all going to be in my thrift stores. 
There you go. Yeah. Well, they know where to go. Well, they'll know where to go. They'll know where I go and get all my good stuff. This really is taking. I, I have not missed it there. <laughs> I do believe. I be, I'm a firm believer in misting. You don't need to miss. Well, you're just trying to prove that to me, but I'm trying to mist a lot, so you can't <laughs> prove it to me. That, okay. How do you know? How do you know it doesn't work about the misting? Because I missed it everything. Well, because we have the water down paint, and I just feel like uh, well, it's you're pretty watery. Well, you're, you're right. I'm going to go over the hardware because I Oh, yeah, definitely. Oh, yeah. This is this is a go over the hardware kind of band. Yeah, yeah. yeah. for sure. Good. It is looking really good. Now we're gonna have cake. Right? We're gonna have cake. We're gonna let this dry. We're gonna have some cake. It, look at the top. I did a little on the top. Yeah, no, I, I'm excited too. To I'm excited. I, yeah, I kind of like went for it. Because it's so smooth. You'll have to agree that it's smooth. Well, it should be smooth. She sanded it for <laughs> like a good 45 minutes. <laughs> I, I do love sanding though. Do other people love to sand? Mm. It's. A, it's Mm, not so much. No. I, you know what? I find it dragging a little bit on top. Oh, here we go. Misting. 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 Mist, mist. Okay. But it was dragging. Didn't you feel like it was dragging? Maybe a little. Yeah. yeah. Mm -hmm. Now, is it dragging? No. Well, I'm, I'm going to go bit. over yours if you don't mind. Oh, look at the bleed through. It's okay. It's going to be fine. It's going to be fine? Are you sure? Yeah. Are you sure we shouldn't like... Um, use uh, some. We'll see. We'll see what happens with this first coat, and then we will determine what we're after going to after we do. eat some cake. We're gonna eat some cake though. Eat first. cake. I mean, it is your now, birthday. it is my birthday. And you guys, I thought she was turning 62 because she kept saying I'm 61. So of well, course, what would I'm... you turn? So I bought 62. So we're gonna have to shave down a candle now. Yes, we have to DIY. I have to DIY my own birthday candle. <laughs> All right, so we're gonna just let that dry, and we're gonna well, eat some did cake. You, did you paint these? Uh, well, or the inside. inside? All right, all right. <laughs> Gotta be the quality control person. I. Uh, mm -hmm. There we go. Boom. Done. Done. Drop the mic. Drop the mic. <laughs> Do you have a mic? No, but <laughs> probably should have one. Yeah. Oh, I don't think any of anybody would be able to hear me. Okay. So we're gonna let that dry and we're gonna eat some cake. <gasps> she was telling me about my handle. Uh oh. <laughs> the quality control person. The quality control person, person from Lansing and how do we do it? Em, <laughs> look over here. Oh. oh, there's a little handle oh. issue over here. Not much, not much. Nothing oh, that heavens. Is, not, nothing that a second coat couldn't take care of. I know, but did I really miss a big place? I don't know. Take a look. All right, so I presented her with this cake. <laughs> He's in a kind of a good place there. <laughs> Way up again. To be, to be clear, Kelly says she did not write that. I did not. I swear the person who I maybe bought the you cake. Could've, maybe you could have done a better job. <laughs> so um, I thought she was turning 62, but actually she is turning 61. So we're going to make this into a one. Right, so I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to just make this for her. Have to carve up my own no, you shouldn't. Candle. Oh, this is not going to be good. Oh, shoot. You know. Okay. So, my. <laughs> um, well, I thought we were. Oh. What? What would you think? Here. Here. <laughs> I'm destroying her candle. My poor candle, and I'm trying to pick out which plate we're going to eat. Well, this could be interesting. It could be like a. Oh, it'll just have a couple. And then we could shove that this in there. It doesn't look good, does it? Yeah. <laughs> we can't shove that in there. We can't. All right, you guys, just know that she's not turning 62. She's turning 61. We're going to make it work somehow. Yeah, I think this looks good. There. That's 61. Oh, my goodness, you guys. Yeah. <laughs> there we go. Put it in All there. right, so we're going to put that in her... Oh, God. <laughs> Yeah, All right, you guys, it. just look at this. This looks like embarrassing. I'm so sorry. Yeah. Anyway, she is 61, not 62. All right, so. I'm sorry, Kelly. I don't have matching plates because I buy all my plates at the thrift store. So 
So we and got this little hodgepodge, hodgepodge here. Hodgepodge of plates. And I get to pick. Now, this was my grandma's set, but obviously that's not a plate. I bought this at the thrift store, and that was the thrift store. I bought this off eBay. Let's see. Uh, we only need more. we only need two. We only need two. Only two? <laughs> only two. Okay. Well, you'll want a big piece, so I'll give you this one. <laughs> yes, I do. Or this would make a better set. Let's eat off of these. Okay, okay, we'll eat off of those. Okay. But it's really cool not to have any matching plates. I just gave up on having matching plates. I think that you accomplished that. Yes. I did. I did. <laughs> okay. But some people think it's weird. <laughs> oh my gosh, look at you. Oh, my hair looks like Bozo the Clown. <laughs> I usually get so many compliments on it. <laughs> At least get compliments. Well, 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 it's been a hard day. I gotta tell you folks, it's really been a hard day. Is that a knife that you're gonna kill me with? Yeah. <laughs> oh my god, it's like a machete. <laughs> I hope so. I hope you enjoyed it. I have. I have. Let me see if I can blow this out. Yay! I'm going to spare her of my singing. Oh, jeez. <laughs> <laughs> so, she's not going to stab me with a knife, but it's going to actually it's be the scissors. scissors. The scissors. And then I'll glue gun her. <laughs>
from your side or no? Oh yeah, I think that'll be you good. You think that'll be good? Yeah, so we'll paint the big stripe All right, first. So we'll do that and then after that we'll go in and make a little smaller stripes. Yes, I think Sound so. Sound good? Yeah. Okay, do we have a stencil brush? Yes, or? we do, you saw it. Oh yeah, I did. It was over there. Um, Yes. And we, and we need a little thing of pink, a decanter. Oh my gosh, we need a decanter again. Yeah. But um, we're going to use Hurricane Gray. I just bought this. I really like this color. And we're going to use our stencil and we're going to do this green stripe. Okay. Do you want to just... Oh, oh. Hold on. <laughs> I was getting ready to dip my brush and go oh. like this. And then I got this disapproving face. Must take out, put on plate. Do you see that? She has these little popsicle kind of sticks that I have to literally. Yes, that's what you should do. See, isn't that a good idea? Mm -hmm. Uh-huh. Yeah. That's how they do it here in Lansing. In I Lansing, guess. yeah. Okay, so basically what we're gonna do is we're just gonna dip our stencil brush in here. And then we're gonna stencil. Do you want a stencil? Oh or? no, 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 I'm afraid of stencil. Well, don't be afraid. Okay. Okay, so basically, make sure your tape's down so it doesn't bleed underneath there. Yeah. And I'm just going to stencil this. Oh, I think it's looking very good. It's, it's going to be beautiful. Good. There's some kind of like fuzzy, fuzzy on the brush. Probably cat hair. Because remember, <laughs> there's no dog hair in this, in this no. video. There's cat there's hair. There's cat hair. Did I tell you like 15 times that my cat has had their teeth cleaned yesterday? Yeah, you did yeah. tell me that. Yeah. Oakley had to have three teeth removed Ooh. and Russell Springs had to have two. And the dental assistant, when she came in uh, the first time, she said, do you do dental care on your cats? And I was like, are you <laughs> kidding me? They don't even let me pick them up. Yeah, right? <laughs> yeah. Okay, that was good. Okay, so uh, we did that. I did? Yeah, I'll look, right there. Oh, nope. I did. You I did. did. Yeah. Oh my gosh. Okay. Okay. okay, so I'm just gonna peel this off right now. Wait, oh, oh my God, like right now. Boom. There we go. And oh. we're gonna let that dry and then we're gonna do smaller ones. Okay. Okay, so now that this is dry, we're gonna make our smaller stripe. And so to do that, I'm just gonna kind of tape over this just slightly. To leave the white space. Yep, to, to leave the white. Yep, perfect. And then we're gonna use, uh, I'll just the other reuse piece. this here. And yep. We're gonna put this really close because it's gonna be a smaller stripe. I definitely like a small stripe. Yep, how's that look? Does that look straight? Oh, you know what? This still has paint on it. Oh yeah, probably I'm gonna use, use a, yeah. a whole new piece. I'm gonna, yeah, why skimp on that? Yeah. We can afford it. We can afford that. Okay, so we're gonna do that really close because we yeah. want a nice thin stripe. Yeah, I think that looks Does that look good. good? It does. Okay, because I'm on the side. Do you want to come to this side? To make sure for me. Oh no, it looks great. I think it looks great. Okay, okay, so here we go. We're gonna dip our brush in again. I, although, no, no. Well, you can paint right there. It's not enough. Oh, really? Okay. All right, you guys. Here we go. She's a very fast stenciler. I don't know if she caught it when I <gasps> pulled the tape off last time. Oh yeah, she it got was a very scared. Tape pullage. She got very scared. I did get scared. <laughs> But I'm learning to embrace it. Yeah, you want to keep moving on with your projects or you're only going to get one done. Uh, yeah. And it's what? it's not like you're skimping. I mean, you're just oh, going no. fast doing it. Oh, yeah, all. definitely. Well, and we got to make it. It has to look good when it gets done. I mean, that's the main that's thing. The thing. That's your goal at the end. Okay, all right, here so. she goes. Ooh, rip it off, girl. Rip yeah. it off. That looks Doesn't fabulous. Doesn't that look great? That looks absolutely fabulous. Okay, so um, I really think we should do just one more little small one on that side. We're gonna let that dry and then we're yeah. gonna do one more little we're small one. We're gonna do a small one. one. Okay, so we have decided that we are not gonna put an extra stripe. Nope. Delane really likes it this way and this is her basket, so we're gonna keep it like that, but we are gonna use this fabulous stencil that she has and yeah. we're gonna stencil that right onto our basket. Okay, so now, that we have our green stripe done here. We are gonna, I, I'm gonna actually tape this down. Yes. Because we don't want that to move. We're gonna put no a little- No shifting. No shifting at all. We need a little tape here. Could you rip me out a little piece there? Mm -hmm. Something without paint. No. Oh. <laughs> Sorry. Now I've got paint on my hands. Uh, more paint on my hands. 
Um, we could afford another piece. We could, I know. We could. <laughs> I just really, I always I don't want reuse to break, the, <laughs> to break the bank, right? Yeah. Okay, that's perfect. Okay. All right, and so now we're gonna go do the same process. We're gonna stencil that on. I'm gonna try to stencil. Yep, I want her to do it. Okay. You can oh, do that's the whole thing. Look at that pouncing. You got this. You I got, got a this. pouncing motion. Yep. Keep on going, keep on going. You got this. I, I fully believe in the decanting system. You know, I don't want to have my paint smelling. I don't believe it. I know. Yeah. But we can agree to disagree. That's right. Yeah. She'll be taking all this really good paint home and not decantering it. Yeah, it's not going to happen. It's not going to happen. Mm -hmm. I really think she's an overachiever. I really do. I think she's an overachiever. Okay, okay, okay. Well, I am aged now. Moment of oh, truth. Oh, it's like the most perfect Look at stencil this. Oh ever. Gosh, you did awesome. I did do pretty good, yes. didn't I? You guys, look at this. That is I like mean, awesome. I mean, seriously. That's some good stenciling. That is some good stuff there. Now we got good stenciling. <gasps> Yay! Yay! I'm proud of you. You did really good. Me yes. too. This is my this is a better look. Oh, I love this. Look. I do too. Alright, you guys. I think I we, stained we forgot to put a hang tag. So yes. she has all the French ones and I have to show you what she did. Can you tell them what you did to yeah, these? Yeah, these are um eyelets. And so I use the eyelet setter. You know, just punch a hole in it, yeah. put the eyelid in there. I just think it adds a really good weight. It, it really does. And I, this is coffee stained paper. Nice. Coffee dyed paper. I mean, I really love what she did. Yes. Look at this. Look how beautiful they are. They look fabulous. Yes. Fabulous. So we're just going to add one of those to our basket and that's it. We're done. We're done. So we're just going to use this beautiful hang tag to, to give it a finished look here. Not that it needs it because this is really a fabulous it looks awesome. Isn't it awesome? And I'm running the camera right now. She is. is it I let her do it. I did. Yes. Yes. This is kind of fun. So we're just going to tie that on there. I think I made it a little too short, but that's okay. Well, we do have more. We do have more, but you know. Yeah. It's going to be just fine. Let me see how you did it. Okay. I don't know about that. Maybe we have to redo it. Oh, uh, yeah. Let's redo it. No, I think it looks does good. It look good. Yeah, it does look good. All right, so we added the hang tag, which just adds a little more. Again, this turned out fabulous. It sure did. This is um, Delane's, and she can do whatever she wants. If she wants to sell it, she can do that. Yeah. She can keep it. I think it's a great memory, and I think I'm going to keep it. Aww. Because this has been just a fabulous day. Aww. Now we gotta get the horn. Thank you guys for watching. I hope you enjoyed it. <laughs> <That's only part. laughs> oh my god. Oh I blew. <laughs> Delaine, thank you so much for inviting me into your home, for taking me to all your favorite places. I had the best day ever, and I hope that you had the best birthday ever. And I hope you guys love Delane as much as I did. She is an absolute hoot. If you like this episode of Flea Market Rescue and you want to see more episodes, make sure to subscribe to my channel and ring the bell. I'm Kelly Sherry, and this has been Flea Market Rescue.